Well, I can answer the question about uh, what this project means to me and to us. Go ahead. So this project for me and I think for us is important because uh, you know, as you go through life you think about what is my mark that I want on the planet, what is it that I can do and offer to the society and to people to make the planet a better place and uh, I think this is something that we can do to make uh, improvements in our local community and communities all over the world and hopefully we can be an example of building in a responsible way. That's great. Yeah, that's really good. And I, 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 you know, Monica said it perfectly, so I don't have much to add to that piece. Uh, but what's really gratifying for me is the community that's coming together and um, the fact that we can assemble a room full of people to do this design charrette uh, that have never met each other before, uh, that are experts in the field, that have a lot to say and a lot of knowledge uh, that is useful to our project but to the community at large and, and to each other. Uh, so to get them together in dialogue and to help them uh, fill the holes in the knowledge gap. Again, no, no one of us can actually answer the questions that are coming forward. There is no perfect answer in this green technology. There is no one answer in this green technology. And so I think what's valuable is uh, the shared experience through the dialogue and the relationships that are being built in this community. Uh, and uh, as I mentioned, when we had our, our shred earlier, uh, we ended the shred at 3 o'clock and then we went out on our deck and at 4 o'clock there were people still out there uh, talking and sharing and, you know, just building relationships with one another. And, uh, you know, it's no one thing that's going to get this done, but it's certainly the relationships uh, that are being built uh, over time that will help it get done. That's great.